everybody, it's Paula from Positive Energy and today is going to be your 15 minute flow for freestyle fitness yoga. Now um, there's lots of yoga out there, my kind of style is all about flowing movements, connecting together and increasing the stretch of the muscle but going to the level that you're happy with so it's all individual to you. I tend to work on balance, I will work on a flow and then we'll look at a couple of different sort of yoga poses to, to think about. I will work on the left side, I will work on the right side, so whatever I do on one side I will do on the other to balance you up. It doesn't matter what level of fitness you are, you just come in and out of the moves that suit you. If you're not as low as me, it doesn't matter. As long as it looks good in your head, that's absolutely fine with me. So take the movements really slow, try not to hold your breath, just make sure that you're breathing normally. Now yoga is really, really good for stress reduction, good for your mind, excellent for your body in regards to the way it moves. So if you can practice just 15 minutes within your either daily or weekly routine, that'll be amazing. You'll see a difference, especially if you're doing a lot of sitting down with your work um, and you don't move as much and the muscles will get stiff and the joints will get stiff. So let's get on with it. I'll just do it, put a little bit of music on for you. I won't be as chatty through the moves. I want you to appreciate what position you're trying to get in. In. So there'll be teaching points, of course, but just please go at your own level. So I'll pop a little bit of music on. I know it's quite early in the morning, but let's see what we can do. OK, there's a nice little bit of a just relaxing beat there for you. I'm in bare feet. And again, you can work out in whatever you feel comfortable with. Your joggers, you know, if it's a little bit cold, a little bit of a, 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 a top. Breathe it. And exhale down with the arms. Again, breathe in. Feet flat on the floor. Breathe out. That's more. Take one leg. Push forward. Take the other. Push forward. Balance. Center up on those hips. Just flow with the moves forward and back. Try and come back with your feet flat to the floor. Two more. Now to the side. Just a small step across and back other side. Just get the movement through the hips. One more time. Add some arms. Now slow. 
slow it down. So come up and drop the shoulders. Come up. Come 
up. Shoulders the last one. Breathe in now and sit into your imaginary chair. So all I've done is teach individual aspects there and then just flow them all together for you. Your muscles will get warm. It's not an exercise. And your our heart rate will start to increase into chair. Remember to bring the arms in if you feel the need to do so. And set those feet into the floor. One more time and then we will move on to a couple of yoga poses. Breathe it in. Sit into your chair, bring the arms down and hold hands together if you need. Elbows up nice and high. Remember, keep the gap between your legs for me. Try not to let those knees meet. Push up. Done everybody. Now you've got some warrior poses to be looking at today. So I want you to step forward with one leg. I will do them both. And then it's up to you how wide you go. What I'd like you to think about is blocking your back foot. So maybe slightly turning it on an angle. Move your hips to the front and slightly bend that front knee. Okay, if we're not that flexible, you may be in this high position. Okay, but you could stretch it out a little bit more. So hips to the front. We're just going to start to raise our arms up. We'll start with yoga poses. You may feel a stretch on this inner thigh. Any knee issues, you may just want to think about maybe pushing and pulsing on that front leg. It is entirely up to you. So we're going to raise our arms up. And all I would like you to do is take your arms down by your side and then just lean slightly forward. You're moving and mobilizing from the hips and you're not moving this way. Repeat again so we lift. We lift. You'll stretch here on the underside of your hamstring. We lift. Push 
So I'm going to hold you in downward facing dog position. I'm just going to pedal those feet. So I'm just going to pedal the feet. Come up onto that toe. Look right up onto that toe. Four more. I'm having a great time this morning. I hope you guys are all right. Back into cat for me. So just drop down. Now I want you to stretch with your bottom towards your heels. And then very slowly, come on up. That's a little bit more than 15 minutes. I got carried away there. Squeeze those arms back. Sit yourself down onto your heels. If you can't get to your heels, you might be up a little bit in a position like that. And then just bring those arms forward and push them away. So there's some traditional poses in there. We had some balance, we had some breath work, we had some traditional warrior ones, okay? And then a little bit of downward facing dog for you. All my yoga classes are about 30 to 40 minutes and they're all online at the moment. Just to let you know, I have a YouTube channel, Positive Energy, Health and Fitness. If you want to subscribe to it, then all of the, the workouts are on there. So you're more than welcome to go and click and play at any time you like. I'm going to be back tomorrow for our Gehapa State with a live mix and match for you for the end of the week. I hope you enjoyed that this morning. Hope you feel a little bit more energised and a little bit more ready for the day. Have a lovely day and I will see you tomorrow. If you're going to join me, see you. Bye.